السلام عليكم مبين فروم أستراليا السلام عليكم وعليكم السلام شيخ هاوي الحمد لله أخي مبين ويلكم تو أسك هدى Yeah, it's a pleasure. Uh, my question is regarding the uh, moon sighting of Ramadan. Yes. Uh, especially in countries like Australia and America, uh, especially in Australia, uh, we have a problem. We are split into two groups. Yeah. One follows the um, uh, calendar, automatic uh, calculation system. The other follow uh, like uh, manual moon sighting. And they always uh, have like one day difference. Mm. So which is the better way um, uh, to follow? طيب أخي مبين. Thank you for asking this question. And guess what? I am ready to receive tens of questions about the same matter. And the issue of having the division among the Muslim community in the West, North America and Australia and all over Europe, whether shall we follow the uh, calendar and the calculations, shall we follow NASA or shall we follow uh, the moon citation? In brief, the messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, said, Sumu li ru'yatihi wa aftiru li ru'yatihi. You should begin fasting upon seeing the crescent. And you should celebrate Eid whenever you see the crescent and then you see his fasting. So the Messenger of Allah, peace be upon him, has guided us to the determining factor of the beginning of Ramadan. And the determining means of uh, the end of Ramadan, which is the moon citation. In case that it's cloudy, the Prophet ﷺ said, then ثلاثين. I cannot see if, if tomorrow, if today they were going for moon citation, the 29th of Sha'ban, and it's cloudy, they cannot see, then make Sha'ban 30 days. When some people say, according to the calculations, I'm a very simple guy. You know, when it comes to fasting, I follow the Prophet ﷺ. So I'm going to follow what he said. And when I was living in North America, in Texas, it happened a few times that the moon citation was a day earlier than the calculation. So you come to me and you say, well, uh, you are not wearing glasses, you have weak eyesight and you make fun of me. Not a problem. I'm going to fast according to what I was able to see because this is an act of worship. We definitely seek the help of the calculations in the calendar and NASA. Thank you so much. But what determines the beginning of fasting is the moon citation. And if the matter is up to me, and if I'm in charge of the affairs of the Ummah or I have a word to be heard, I would say, you brothers and sisters, any country on earth, let it be Bangladesh, Kashmir, Palestine, Saudi Arabia, it's just one of the countries, you know. There is no special favor because Saudi Arabia has the haram. But any country that was able to cite the moon first and physically with evidence say, MashaAllah, we have the Christian of Ramadan, so Ramadan is tomorrow, I would follow that country right away. Why? Because it was confirmed with eyewitnesses that Ramadan has begun because it's only one Christian. But because of, I'm not in charge of the affairs of the Ummah, and because of, I don't want to cause any further splits in the Ummah, I would say go with the flow of your community and you're not blameworthy. May Allah guide us to what is best.